guys. So, let's talk. <laughs> uh, it's not, okay, let me just say I'm not being negative, okay? That's not my persona. But I just wanted to update you guys from some things I'm see, seeing. Um, I have never worked a seasonal job at all. Um, once again, if this is your first time watching my video. Um, I deal with depression, and it gets worse during the winter months. People go through the, a lot of mood changes during the like fall and winter times because of like the sun not not being as much sun and so forth. Anyways, I picked up a seasonal job because I wanted to be active first and foremost i work from home um all and so i'm home all the time okay so i i'm just trying to get out the house and be active um i had gained a lot of weight because of the medication i was on so now i'm losing the weight but mentally i just needed to get physical and get out the house and get active hence why I apply for seasonal jobs. So the one I'm working right now is Kohl's. And my first day was Thursday of last week. Um, that was my orientation day. You know, you fill out all your paperwork. It only lasted an hour and a half. And they had truck to follow on Friday that next day. So I went in. I've been working from 5 a.m. to noon time. Now, if, is that the information I had on my availability sheet? No, it's not. But I'll work with it because we know Amazon is starting later on. And I'll get that all situated out when that comes time. Um, so what was next? Um, the pay is $9 an hour. Now, I, this is what I wanted to go over with you guys, too. I wanted to go over with you guys the pay because... You do get paid a little bit more uh, for working certain days, and I'll get to that. But this main video is to say, don't get discouraged. Please don't. Um, don't take things personal. Be yourself. Um, you're not there to be friends with people, okay? You're there for a job, just like any job. You're there for... You're there for money, you're there to get out the house. Whatever your purpose is, don't think a job is about making friends. Not everybody is there to make friends. People want their go there to make a paycheck. So with that being said, uh, over the course of a past, you know, I only worked there like re really, really past. There was two days, so Friday of last week, and then I worked today, which is Monday. And... I know it's busy, um, and people are getting lazy, uh, they feel like they're being overworked and stuff, so people are starting to be rude, okay, um, I'm a bubbly person, I'm not, I'm not a bubbly person, but I like to be positive, that's me, you know, yeah, I can be rude, but that's not me, I don't need to be rude, I'm not that type of person, you know, um, so with that being said, one of the, I don't know if she's a manager or the second like person next to the manager. She was just really grumpy today, and everybody was like, "What is her deal?" You know, I'm like, "Don't take it personal," but I'm like, "I seen it too." Um, there was another lady. I was just walking, and she was about to cross, and I'm like, "Oh, go ahead." She said, "No, I'm putting stuff away like that," and I'm like, "Okay, why is she being rude?" But, but. On the first day of orientation, she came through the office. She's like, oh, I hurt my back. And the lady said, oh, I hope you feel better. She's like, yeah, but I still got to be here. And I mean, just how she said it. And the lady, the the person that was, uh, who said it to her, she looked and she was like, oh. so I just know that's that lady's personality, I guess. Um, and the other thing is, I'm not saying ret retail is cool for a permanent job. But you figure some people get burnt out, okay? Just like with any job. Some people just need a break. And I, I'm happy because I'm going there. And I, <laughs> I, 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 I can't say this for everybody, but I'm going there not for the money. That's not, it's not for the paycheck. It's not for extra money. It's just to get out the house. No, I am not trying to make friends. I'm just happy to be out the house. 
So I'm all happy, and people are looking at me like, why is she so happy? And, um, but I'm not going to let them tear me down, like, because everybody else want to be in an ugly mood and not be happy. Yeah, you're up in the morning. You signed up for this. Come on now. It's n Nobody put you up for this. Okay, no, you don't have to be all, oh, how you doing, and stuff like that. But at the same time, you don't have to be rude. Um, some people are more laid back than some others because most some of the people I work with they're regular you know regular people I'm seasonal and some other people are seasonal it seems like the seasonal people are working harder than the long-term people because obviously we're just getting there um but you know I'm just taking my time I was going fast in the beginning but I'm like Everybody else taking it slow ain't no problem. I'm not saying I'm dragging my feet, but I'm not going fast, fast, fast. Um, but we're, we're getting all our work done. But I keep seeing, you know, a lot of negative reviews on, like, is it Glassdoor? And indeed, when you go to, like, the reviews. And there are some, on, there are some videos on YouTube I did find. It doesn't say seasonal jobs, but it talks, if you put in Kohl's, you'll get some experience at Kohl's type of videos. Um, it's, it's, it's work, okay? It's work. You make it what it is, okay? You make it what it is. Um, I just don't like when people, I just don't want people to, this be their first job because I know there may be some young kids trying to apply. This may be their first job since, you know, graduating from high school. Just keep a positive outlook. Just know, hey, I'm here for my paycheck. I'm not here for friends. They may be in a bad mood, but they ain't going to get me down. <laughs> you know what I mean? I just want you guys to stay positive because today... Between those two situations, I was like, why am I even here? That's what I was thinking to myself. I'm like, kids, don't, don't think like that. And then I'm all bubbly and then I'm asking questions because, yes, you're seasonal and they're busy doing stuff. Even when, so, you learn as you go. That's how you're doing things. Now, some other places, they have you stand with somebody and... Everything, like the first day, yes, I worked with a girl and she, you know, showed me the ropes. Um, but she was a seasonal person that just started a day before me. So a seasonal person that started one day before me is helping me. Um, but she, she's good, you know. I'm good now, too. <laughs> like, I could show somebody else something. But it was just like, wow. So I see what people talk about, but just know that's part of it unfortunately especially I don't know if that's what every place I'm pretty sure probably what it is because you're getting paid you're kind of you're just there temporary you know so they don't have to show you all of the ropes um but I just don't know like it came up in my mind briefly right and I'm just like wow so this is all of the reviews I've read where they're like they don't teach you nothing people are rude I'm thinking, like, some people are there are actually for the paycheck. I'm not there for the paycheck. If I was there for the paycheck, would I still be bubbly? Yeah, because you know what, you guys? I will say this. I will say this. I was like, man, you know how I said I'm not going to be speaking with no customers. I'm here just to stock. Tell me why I feel like I have to. <laughs> It feels like I have to be like, oh, how you doing? And um, all this stuff and smiling and because I'm happy. But the uh, the store has been opening up at 8 o'clock. So you figure I've been there for three hours about the time they come in. But I'm like, oh, are you finding everything okay? And I'll be hoping they say yes because I don't know where everything is at. <laughs> I said that today. And I said, yo, y'all, you know, it's a group of us. And I was like, y'all, I don't know. Where nothing is at really, and here I am asking people, You find everything okay? So when they said no, I'm like, Oh man, <laughs> it's so funny. But the other people, they don't interact with the customers because you figure you're still there from eight to, to noon, and you got customers walking. And I go, I, I seen a lady, she had a baby in a, uh, a stroller. And she was carrying this heavy box. It was like a, 
it was a heavy box. I forgot what they call it. But anyways, it was like a t uh, the bean, bean toss game, you know. So it was heavy. And here she is, because they had a handle on the top, and she's dragging it along. And I was like, she walked past two of my male co-workers, a female co-worker. And I was like, ma'am, do you need help? She's like, I guess. I'm like, yeah, come on. Like, okay, I understand we're there to stock, but look at her. She has, a, like, the baby had to be, like, probably one years old. She can't do much. You know, and I made sure I got her her the stuff out into the car. There was a lady today, older lady, older lady, holding like a big comforter. You know, you know comforters are small, but they're not too heavy either. But they're just huge, and she's short. She's short like me. So here you are trying to walk with this big old thing in front of you. So I was like, ma'am, do you need help with this? You need me to get you a cart. She's like, you know what? Yeah, but you know, I was I didn't want to walk all the way to the front of the um of the store. I'm like, no problem, you know. I'll be right back. So she's like, I gotta use the bathroom. I said, you know what? I'll go give me this. I'll bring it with me. I'll put it in the cart, and when you come out, it'll be right there in front, um, right there by customer service for you. And she's like, Oh, you're so sweet. It's things like that. I mean, no, I'm not there for customer service, but I don't feel I don't feel right just walking past people and acting like they're not there. I just don't think that's right, and that's what a lot of the stocking people do. Um, so they look at me, <laughs> and even like management, they look at me like, "Why is she talking to those people?" I'm like, "Oh, how you doing? Oh, I'm so sorry about our mess and all this stuff. You know, making small talk." <sighs> Another thing, I don't know if all Kohl's are like this. I have never been to a Kohl's like this. And once again, I don't shop at Kohl's often. But when I used to live in New York, I went to Kohl's, two different Kohl's before, you know. This Kohl's, it drives me crazy. It drives me crazy. What do they call it? Um, it's not a free-for-all. Oh, I forgot what they call it. But, like, if you find a spot, put it there. Even if it don't belong here, stock it. So it's not organized. It is not organized, you guys. And I was like, are you sure? And it's like, yeah, no. We don't want to backfill anything. Put it out. Just put it out. So you can put something anywhere you want to. And I'm like, and stuff be on the floor nobody picks it up and oh we have two people that come in and they work on the the clothing and stuff like that but I'm like what about the bedding like people open things up and they're laying there like I just want to clean <laughs> when I'm there for some reason I just want to clean but you know I gotta get this stuff out and now when I think about it would I want to work there if they offer me a permanent part-time position, would I want to stay there? I would do it. I would do it because people don't get me down. I have i don't allow that stuff to happen to me. <laughs> Let's just put it like that. I'm not there for you. You're not there for me. You got issues. I don't got those same issues. <laughs> but I just thought I should update you guys on those things because... People that may be starting out or just, you know, getting out there. I just don't want y'all to get turned off, you know, because that can be easily done. Prior to me and the other persons getting hired, there were, what they said, four or I think four people quit at the same time. I said, for what? Different departments say, no, for the stocking positions here. I think she said four to six people. I think it was four. I was like, no, you're lying. She's like, no, really. I was like, wow, okay. Because people don't know how to treat people. But whatever. Um, 